Hello, welcome to Dan's Hobby Room. So a few years ago, there was mention of a group build on doing your first car. And I don't know if I missed it or I didn't see it or what, but or it didn't happen. So anyway, I got to thinking I sh about my first car and figured that I would do build mine. So I checked on eBay and actually found the car and bought it and built it. So let's take a look. And here it is. It's the 1981 Ford Escort. Nope, it's not a Camaro or it wasn't a hot rod. It was the Ford Escort. So, after graduating high school, I moved up to Westminster, Maryland, and my mother's boyfriend had this car, and he sold it to me. And it's stick shift, that's where this is where I learned how to drive stick. And on the weekends I'd go back to my hometown and party it up. And we had a lot of fun times in this car. So if you notice on the hood, we have the Metallica Ride the Lightning album cover. So a friend of mine he was a airbrush artist and he actually painted this on my hood. It's pretty awesome. And then I, uh, when I bought this model, I looked on eBay and found a guy that had a sticker. This sticker, and it was the right size. I had to cut it a little bit to get it to fit on the hood right. But it was perfect size. <clears throat> so I got that, that was pretty awesome. And then on the hood, or the roof, I should say, you'll see a Remax for sale sign. Now the story behind that is this car had a sunroof. And it was one of the types that would open up in the back. The back part of it would open. And then the whole thing would slide out. You could take the whole glass out and have it completely open. So... From time to time, while I'm driving down the road, I would take the sunroof out. You know, and everything was fine until one day I decided to take it out. And the wind caught it and blew it straight up in the air. And I looked in my rear view mirror and watched it hit the ground and shatter into pieces. So then I had a hole in my roof and one of the guys I used to work with installed real estate signs. So then we got the idea to take a real estate sign and use it as my sunroof. So that was pretty fun. Then I've gone out, out in the snow, pulling the emergency brake, sliding her around, and I ended up breaking my wheel, coming to the parking lot and I went to go slide and she went straight right into the curb, broke my steering and the wheel. Then a friend of mine, we used to go bowling, won a bowling league every Saturday, and the back of the parking lot had gravel in it, so every Sunday we'd come in there, pull the emergency brake, go sideways, doing a little drifting around the bowling alley until I smacked the ass end on the bowling alley. Hit the wall a little bit, it wasn't too bad. But the funny thing is, is I still actually have this car. So, if you want to see it, take a walk with me. All right, so we're outside. I told you I still had the car, so let's take a look. Eh, it's not actually all the car. It's just the hood. Unfortunately, the car had bent a couple rods and valves, and she had to be put down, but not before I took the hood off. And I couldn't part with the hood. I had to save the hood. Especially a nice artistic airbrush job on there. Got a little black stuff on there. I don't know what that is, but let's see if I can't get that off. It's 
So that's it. That's the 81 Ford Escort. What's left of it? I'll have to keep that hood forever. Thanks for watching.